In other news, a popular pharmaceutical store and warehouse has been shut down by the National Agency for Food and Drug Administration and Control due to the sale of Schedule 1 narcotics and unregistered products. The agency says the seizure of pharmaceutical products is worth about 30 million naira as it will continue to undertake these routine enforcement exercises in order to keep the public health of the nation safe. Health correspondent Kemi Balogo reports. The National Agency for Food and Drug Administration and Control is once again raiding the streets of Abuja and neighboring suburbs within the Federal Capital Territory. Pharmaceutical stores who have failed in their duties are on their list. Locked up stores and a seal to stamp the authority of NAFDAQ, indicating that the shops are not in use until further notice. This is now the reality of this popular pharmaceutical store located in the nation's capital city. The defaulting pharmacy has been caught selling Schedule 1 narcotic drugs, which are controlled due to their addictive ability. All other health institutions are supposed to go to the Federal Medical Store under the Federal Ministry of Health to purchase their Schedule 1 narcotics for the needs of their patient. However, we receive an intelligence that this premises is into sales and stocking of Schedule 1 narcotics. That is the reason why we are here. And surprisingly, we got one of the Schedule 1 narcotics being stocked inside these premises. During the International Narcotics Board meeting, every country is given a specific quantity of these products for the needs of their country. So at the end of the year, the Narcotics as Control Substances Director of the NAVDAC do go back for a meeting to tell them how we utilize this quantity that was given to us in Nigeria. That is the reason why it's not supposed to be purchased by any other person apart from the Federal Ministry of Health so that there should be control because they are addicted to substances. The agency says the pharmacy also engages in selling unregistered and fake products. We have these products. This is not the one that NAVDAC registered. And if you go to the market now, the price value of this particular product is about 7,000 naira. Yet, we have the counterfeit version of it. The agency also takes another journey through the streets of Day Day, a suburb in the FCT, as it goes further to raid these men who engage in black market sales of sexual enhancement drugs on public roads. Confiscated a lot of unregistered products some of them are herbal products that are harmful to our citizens. And we'll continue to do that with the cooperation and collaboration that we're enjoying from our sister organizations. NAVDAC says it will carry out proper investigations and impose sanctions before the stores can be reopened.